Welcome to the installation of the Thule 9034 and 9035 T2 platform style hitch bike carrier. The T2 can accommodate virtually any bike frame and tire size. To begin installation, place the auto pin into the open position and slide the stinger assembly into the hitch so that the hitch and stinger holes align. Then close the auto pin so it engages with the stinger hole. Then using the change key, install the lock cylinder into the lock knob. Begin turning the knob clockwise until it is firmly snug. Shake the stinger side to side to ensure that it's secure to the hitch. If it's loose, further tighten the knob. To lock the knob, turn the key 90 degrees counterclockwise. When locked, the knob will spin freely. With the mast in the vertical position, begin installing the top tray. Make sure the ratchet arm pivot is located on the passenger side of the vehicle. Match the threaded inserts on the bottom of the tray with the slots in the attachment plate. Loosely tighten each 5mm screw with the Allen wrench provided. Line up the tray so that it is in the middle of the slots. For an easier and faster installation, you can use a ratchet with a 5mm head. Repeat this process for the second tray. Be sure, however, to reverse the orientation so that the ratchet arm pivot is on the driver's side of the vehicle. Next, install each front wheel holder by aligning the four holes with the pointed end facing inward. Secure each wheel holder to the trays using four 4mm self-tapping screws. Slide each rear wheel holder onto each tray so that the buckle faces up and away from the vehicle. Then install each end cap into each tray using one 4mm self-tapping screw. The T2 offers three positions. Pull the gray handle to bring the trays to the flat horizontal position. You can then bring the trays down to the angled position for better access to your trunk or hatch. Then back to the vertical position when not in use. Using the change key, install the lock cylinders into the cable lock housings. To load a bike, begin by rotating the ratchet arm so that it is in front of the front wheel tray. Load the first bike in the tray nearest to the vehicle with wheels in their respective holders. While holding the bike with one hand, rotate the ratchet arm up and over the front wheel. Then pull the arm down so that the V-notched hook is firmly seated against the tire no more than one inch away from your bicycle's front brake or fork crown. Failure to do so may result in the loss of your bike. Secure the rear wheel by inserting the strap into the pump buckle and ratcheting it down. Make sure the rim protector pad is properly seated. To lock the bike, pull the cable out and wrap it around the wheel or frame and lock the end of the cable into the housing. Please note this is more meant as theft prevention. We advise against leaving the bike unattended for extended periods of time. Thank you for watching the installation of the Thule 9034 and 9035 T2 Pro Hitch Bag Rack. If you have any further questions, please visit rackwarehouse.com or call us at 800-272-5362. And as always, remember, we fit your lifestyle.